What's going on, guys? I wish I had a full video I could put on YouTube, but I don't. I was having technical difficulties with my camera. I got it figured out, but unfortunately not until the very end of the fishing trip, which is usually how that goes. I caught yesterday on uh, cheese franks, you know, hot dog weenies with cheese in them. And uh, I just picked these up uh, at a store on the way out to the lake. I'm gonna show y'all. Uh, you can tell that the brand is, is I, you know, I'm not even really that familiar with this brand. But the thing about using Cheese Franks, there are pros and cons, all right? Um, and I guess it depends on, on how you define a pro or a con. If you hate carp, these are not um, what you want to be using, okay? Now, I... Uh, I caught nothing but channel cat. The channel cat were on fire yesterday. And I caught like six or seven of them. So like I said, I really wish I'd have gotten my technical problems figured out sooner. Uh, but the thing about the, the hot dog franks is that they are the right shape and size to where a carp can fit them in their mouth, even with a circle hook. So you will catch a fair amount of big carp on these hot dog weenies along with catfish. Now, I would rather catch something than nothing, and I don't mind a carp fight now and then. So to me, that's not a con, but just full disclosure, um, you know, it's not like if you were using shad where it's big enough and, and the shape is such that the carp can't inhale it. So just be ready for that. But I really like these. I like them for, for catfish. Um, and the thing about it is if you use the cheese franks, and it doesn't have to be this brand, any brand, that cheese is embedded in the frank to where it's going to just gradually the whole time it's in the water that cheese is going to be dissolving and dispersing so the whole time a cheese frank is in the water it's going to be releasing oil and scent and basically ringing the dinner bell you know whereas if you use just a regular frank could be that over time especially if you're near current that smell that initial smell may be dulls cheese franks continue to release those so i highly recommend cheese franks and here's why we're going to get into this video it's very short but you're going to see that immediately there was a reaction and a decent little catfish caught so enjoy this clip thank you there we go There we go. That was a good one. He's running towards me. Put this one in the pole or I'm gonna lose it. There we go. All right, guys. Yeah, good news is we got him. I think we got him. Yeah. Well, he's gonna try his best to run. Look at him. Look at him running, guys. A good little fish. He's a good little fish. Well, good. We're gonna have us video after all. Might have to loosen our drag. Oh shoot, no. He just a little old thing. He just wasn't even pulling drag because he's not big enough to pull drag. There we go. He decent. He decent. A little better than I thought. Easy, buddy. Easy. A lot of times, if you'll neutralize them in long ground like that, they won't be able to fight as hard. All right, we got us a video. Got us a video. 
Well, that was a good hard pull down. There we go. What? All right. Show you all one more time. A decent little cat. Decent little channel. Pretty.